This um, application that uh, we are seeing uh, here um, is uh, the SCOBOL uh, control set. This is actually a uh, demo that we include uh, with our, our product installation. Um, and um, <coughs> uh, this is uh, to demonstrate uh, how rich is ISCOBOL in uh, graphical controls and uh, how you could um, extend the graphical control that you have available using uh, Java Beans and so. Um, so let's, uh, let's start. Uh, first of all, you can see uh, that um, we have a standard uh, menu bar over here, as you can see in any other um, graphical application. And um, also we have a toolbar, a pretty standard toolbar over here with uh, little uh, icons in it and so. And um, now something um, even nicer over here, we have a uh, tree view that we are using as a menu in this, um, in this case, it can be used for many other um, um, uses that you may think about, but right now this is our menu as well. So if I just uh, uh, select one of these uh, items in the tree view, I am already moving to another view in this um, tab control over here. I'm moving here, I move to another uh, tab, and so on. So this is the tree view over here, pretty nice with the icons, etc. And uh, now in here we have a um, tab view, which is uh, pretty useful to. Um, so sometimes you have to uh, present a lot of information, a lot of data fields to a uh, user, and uh, in order to uh, don't uh, um, overcrowd your your screens, you can just uh, organize your information in different tabs. So you have all all of it. Um, already available, but you are showing just uh, uh, some tab, one tab at a time. So that's it. And now, um, let me show you some of the tabs that we have here, um, where we are showing some um, graphical uh, controls as well. Here in the radio uh, check tab, we are showing uh, different ways you can present your radio buttons, check boxes, uh, how you can use colors to um, you know, enhance the presentation of some graphical control and how you can use bitmaps to enhance the presentation of uh, radio and, and check boxes. So um, that's it here. Now I have another tab for entry fields and uh, in here we are using one entry field to show some specific uh, properties that you can use. Like uh, for instance if you want a numeric only entry field or you want a special 3D entry field or you want an entry field that uh, limits the input to five characters and so on. So we are showing one like this uh, password secure entry field over here. You may combine uh, these uh, properties and put uh, several of them on one single entry field if you want as well. And uh, we have an interesting entry field here, a multi-line one, and so on. Now, on the combo box, well, I have this um, simple graphic over here. And uh, the combo boxes in here, the combo boxes are used to change the view, the look of, of, of this uh, uh, graphic. So if instead of green, I want like uh, blue, then I can change the blue over here. And these combo boxes, you can even include some uh, icon on the items uh, if you want as well. So now uh, let's go to the list box. It is the same. We are showing here how our list box it can be columnized and how you can split. Um, the columns and visually separate them and uh, this is nice and how you can select one and use some vents to show what you are selecting um, and so on. We have several here. Now let me go to the grid which is very interesting. Um, as you can see this grid over here is a very powerful grid where you have uh, things like uh, you can move the columns. Um, you may uh, resize them a little bit. Um, you may sort by any column at any time, and, um, and so on. So this is this is kind of a, a, a spreadsheet functionality in just one graphical control with things like that. And you can see other things like the different um, effects that you're applying, like bold in here, some little icon over here, or image, uh, some different colors in other um, of the rows to um, enhance the presentation of them, and so on. And um, this is slide bar over here, 
to change the presentation of uh, the grid and so on. So this is the grid over here and um, well we have others like uh, the page grid which is similar but you have buttons to go page by page um, and so on. Now let me show you, uh, this is interesting, the Java Bean. As I said, if, if uh, you find that um, there is uh, still another kind of graphical control, very advanced graphical control you want to use and it is not included in the ice cobble um, native graphical controls, then you can use Java Beans. It's pretty easy to include a uh, Java Bean graphical control in your applications. As you can see here, this is a container over here for a uh, pie chart, Java Bean, and uh, there are also some uh, bar charts and some line charts and so on. Every one of these is a uh, Java Bean that you can easily include in your uh, graphical applications and uh, uh, you know manage and uh, set it up to show uh, whatever you need to show. And um, let me show you something else here. HTML over here, like for instance, uh, if you want to have like uh, animated GIFs or a hint that looks pretty interesting here, this tooltip over here with colors and images, etc. Then you can use HTML in the properties of your graphical controls. Everything you are seeing here is um, HTML enhanced, like these different font sizes here, these bullets over here, uh, and everything is just uh, via HTML in the properties. So that's uh, something interesting you can uh, use in your graphical application as well. For bitmaps, we have like uh, some interesting uh, bitmaps that you can like double click, and uh, it um, where you can catch the double click event for a bitmap, or uh, a single click, or just a mouse over. So um, basically, uh, this is what I wanted to to show you on on, on how rich um, iScroll is in graphical controls and how you can extend the graphical controls by using um, Java Vince and the uh, last thing here, uh, let's see this uh, resizing uh, functionality here. As you can see, as I resize, everything else gets uh, laid out in the proper place or resized in the proper place. So that's even another functionality, very easy to use functionality that IceCobble uh, includes with um, the, the GUI development.